Walter Rat and Barry Brock. I know they were murdered, but I can't prove it. Ah. I can't pin those murders on any of you. But Rick Toad, now that's a different one. Hey. Let's start with what we know. Mr. Toad was killed while sleeping in his cabana. His dead body was then carried out to the pool. He was a big man, a very big man. Ah. Lifting that body took some considerable strength. It wasn't a job for the delicate or the decorative. Then there's the murder weapon, the spray for roses. It's not been on sale in the States for four years. It is still on sale in Europe, so it's possible that someone brought some into the country. Ah. That stretches credulity thinner than my wallet. We do know that there was a gallon of it sold to Princess Kelly back when it was still legal. She says she left it behind when she sold her house, so maybe it was still there when Marilyn Mansfield bought that property. But there's another name in the frame. I'm not talking about someone who bought any of the next best thing. I'm talking about someone who sold the stuff. Someone who used to work in shops, who climbed to the stars and then found himself falling again. Someone who wanted to take revenge on the men who seemed to be ending his career. That invoice for the pesticide wow. carries the name of the salesman. Ham Jenkins. Harold Jenkins. The original name of Marlon Mead. When that poison got banned, you kept some of it, didn't you, Marlon? You kept it in case there ever came a time when you might need it. That time had come. After you left here last night, you went to a bar to fortify yourself. Then you came back in the dead of night. You killed the oh, toad while he slept. Then you carried his dead body and dropped it in the river, scattering rose patterns in an attempt to throw the blame on someone else. And that's why I'm taking you in for the murder of Rick Toad. Oh. Murderer! So don't have nightmares. That's you awesome. murderer! You are the killer. I was like, shit! <laughs> How far did he say? Three. Bloody oh, hell. Nice. You are the killer. That's why you're like. Yeah. 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 Woo! Whatever you are is. Let me see my love. Rick Toad was obsessed with making the New York town yeah, just a fish. into a smash hit. Even if that was at the expense of Mae Vest and Lancaster. Oh, that's a good one, that. Yeah. He blackmailed Princess Kelly into helping the movie's prospects by threatening to reveal sordid pictures from his past. And he blackmailed Rock Houston into appearing in it by threatening to reveal his sordid affair with Marilyn Mansfield. Funny he didn't try to blackmail Miss Mansfield herself, but maybe he didn't think her reputation was oh, sinking. You're, you're right. Right. Yeah. 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 Yeah